What's up? This is J.D. Wilson, founder of Lead U. Today we are meeting with one of my favorite educators, Michael Bocchicchio. The bike I chose for Mike is a Schwinn Little Chick. Founded in 1895, Schwinn is an American icon. They built some of the best known, most beloved bicycles of all time, as we know. The thing I love about Schwinn is that they believe that learning to ride a bike is a rite of passage that offers fun and adventure, which is perfect for today's guest. Someone who knows a thing or two about fun and adventure, third grade teacher at Frog Pond Elementary, and my brother-in-law, Michael Bocchicchio. This is Educators on Bikes Getting Ice Cream. All right, Keeks, here it is. Schwinn. A Schwinn. Very nice. Yeah, with the uh, with the nice little banana seat. I, you know what? For comfort and yes. speed, I think. Now, wow. You, you might be thinking, why um, why a Schwinn? <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking more why a little chick, but Schwinn. Oh let's yeah, start it is. There. Yeah, it is the <laughs> little chick. The little uh, chick. Well, we'll talk about the little chick part never. Uh, okay. But for right now, we'll talk, we'll talk about why it's a Schwinn. Okay. Schwinn. I looked it up. Uh, obviously, everybody knows Schwinn. They've been around forever. Uh, yes. Um, when I looked it up, I found out that Schwinn believes in really two things, and that is fun okay. and adventure. Ah. And you, of course, not only as a friend, but as an educator, I'm sure your classroom is just filled with fun. Try to. And you have a great sense of adventure. Thank you very much. And those are two reasons why I thought this bike would be perfect for you. The other thing is, you notice, it's kind of, um, what's the word? Uh, it's a kid's bike. Kid's bike. Yes. It's yes. definitely a kid's bike, yeah. and you are a grown-up. Yes. But at heart... Yeah, your kid. Cleverly disguised as a girl. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're yeah. fooling a couple people. <laughs> yeah. So I thought this would be, you know, not everybody's going to get a kid's bike. But no. You deserve a kid's Thank bike. Thank you. I do. I think that's that's definitely appropriate. Absolutely. Sh Schwinn, kid's bike. Definitely. Yeah. You know, the tires are ready to go. The banana seat is all yours. Let's hit the road and grab some ice cream. Very good. Uh, let's do it. The more I teach, the less I'm interested in academics. I think the biggest thing you, you need to do is make them understand that learning is an exciting thing. Like, yeah. like I, I was just telling you about the, uh, the book I was reading about Muggsy Bogues. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I, 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 you know, I'm almost 40 years old. I never knew, I love that I'm learning new things, you know? That's what life's about. Right, exactly. Yeah. So if you can convince, not convince them, but if you could show them that that is something you want to keep doing, then you've won. What's the most ice cream white thing they have here? What's that? Ice cream. You have ice cream? Ice okay. cream is very much like ice cream yeah. I found. <laughs> what kind of ice cream is this? Woohoo! Woohoo! Cinnamon Toast Crunch. There's no. They have Cinnamon Toast Crunch yeah. ice cream? That's what oh, I'm Oh, get out of here. Cold brew ice cream? This is Woohoo. Yeah. Woohoo ice cream. Yeah. Well, how does it go? It's the woo. Oh, it's the woohoo. The woohoo, okay, yeah. I'm oh, sorry, so this is the woohoo. <laughs> what do you recommend uh, smoothie, smoothie wise? What's going on over there? Is it Beach Boy? Oh, I should. How's the Beach Boy without kale? Alright, I like, don't know what to do first. That's not bad. Yeah? You don't taste the kale. <laughs> I always say uh, if the world was run by uh, third graders, there would be no war. Absolutely not. <laughs> they are all, they're just pleasing machines. Yeah, yeah. Like, um, they're like Labrador puppies, you know, and, and they just want to please. Even when they're driving you crazy, right. it might be like, I sometimes I get annoyed, I call it beehiving, when they're just all over, mm -hmm. you know, like, Mr. Bokeya, Mr. Yeah. Bokeya, you know. But even that, if you take a step back, you're like, they just want to be near you. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. So even at their most, most challenging, they're trying to, you know, it's coming from a good place. Absolutely. And it, you, it's, what's funny is no other person, like if I, I don't want to say if I treat an adult like this, because because it's not like I'm mistreating them, but sometimes you have to be firm with them and say no, and you know, you need to do this, and I come down hard on them. Right, absolutely. And if I did that to an adult, they'd be like, what a turd. Yeah. I don't like that person. <laughs>
like, how dare he? Yeah. And third graders, I'll be like, you guys are not walking quietly in line. Well, you know we've done this better. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, right. teacher talk, teacher talk. And they'll go to art. I come to pick them up at art, every one of them. Look what I married, look what I, and I was like, I was just yeah, was reading just, you the riot. Yeah, and just, they yeah, are just over it. You. They yeah. are over it in a second. Right. They, it's, that's, I, that's my favorite thing about third graders is that they are just so forgiving and they just want to please and they're they're just they, and they are a little bit more mature than a second grader yeah yeah um what have you seen yeah i mean what because I, I talk for like like five minutes and compared to you and i always feel people people in education a lot are talking about oh, the shift or like right. what it used to be or um the new math oh, I don't the, get new, the new oh the new math <laughs> the new math was honestly made in 1986 <laughs> this new math and it, it, it's so funny the, uh, it must happen a half a dozen times yeah. parent t parents will come in and they'll be like listen I, I don't know how to help them with the math i mean there's new math it's like and understandable yeah, yeah. It's, that's fine that's fine but it's not a new math right. this is you know there's you know they want it to to it's 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 not a new man it's, it's not a new man it's not a new man i mean it, it's a little bit different they they want it uh it's more conceptual than right than route root memory but and there's some pluses to that for yes sure. definitely but, there, there is but it's not like this is not a completely new mathematical system. Right, right, yeah. right, right, right. The new math. The new math. Oh, I hate the new math. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's like they, it's picket signs. They, they yeah, have them, they'll yeah, be ready yeah. to have the new <laughs> math with the, spy, the uh, ghost uh, buster yeah. symbol over it. You had but, a bad day, we were just like, oh, the new math. The, yeah, yeah, the, it, it yeah. was the new math. Yes. That's who it was. That's right. I know it was. Everything would be fine. Yeah, and then. <laughs> if not, I mean, science went well. Reading, yeah. then new math comes in. All I mean, of a sudden, it's, they're misbehaving. It's, <laughs> that's another thing about teaching. There's always an excuse for the kid not behaving. Like okay. in, se in September, well, they just got here. They just got here. You know? yeah, yeah. In October, they can even do that again. November, holidays are coming. Yeah. Holidays are coming. <laughs> December, like, December. Uh, oh my gosh, Christmas crazy. Yeah. <laughs> the only, the only day you have no excuses is like October 17th. Yes, it's, yes. There's a specific on day October 17th. <laughs> the moon is in the seventh something. Yeah. And, and, if they were if they were misbehaving on that day, you were not yeah, a yeah, teacher. You're, you're, yeah. <laughs> you're Think a... of a new profession. <laughs> it's not working out for you. You taught these kids? I taught a few of these kids, yeah. yeah. And there's my cousin. It's your cousin? Yeah. Okay. How do you, how does one uh, get on this wall? It's an excellent question. Yeah. How I don't do we get? I don't really think there's been much much change um, that I that uh, that I'm too aware of. I try not. I feel a lot of times people look back at the past with these gold, you know, the rose-colored glasses. For sure, yeah. Things yeah. were so much better then. Well, yeah. you were complaining then too. Mm -hmm. You know, and, and yeah, yeah, the old yeah. math. Yeah, yeah, old math. <laughs> oh man, would they get a new math? <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully, the new math comes out soon. I heard these things about new math. Yeah, finally, yeah, 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 right. <laughs> but it is. Uh, but the kids are kids. I mean, uh, there's uh, there's a lot of kids in my class that are dealing with stuff that there's no way I would could deal with as a almost 40 years. It's amazing man. what's on their shoulders, oh, right? Oh, yes, yes. And, and you keep it, that in mind as, you know, whenever, you know, Timmy's having a bad day. Yeah. It's like, wait a minute, well, it's understandable on yes, some level. Yes, yeah, A, B, and C is happening at home. Yeah. Uh, a friend of mine who I teach with uh, always says, I'm always, uh, what word did he use? I'm always so flattered by how hard they'll work for you. Yeah. Because they really, they really will. And, and I remember a friend of mine say I was, being, I was frustrating about, you know, kids calling out or something like that. Yeah. And he goes, you know, they're just being kids, right? I mean, that's what they, that's what kids do. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. if you look at it through that lens, you know, you can, you can. Now, in the moment, do I lose my cool from time to time? Of yeah, course. Absolutely. But, but I, I can honestly say I don't go home and go. It's the kids. Yeah. It's not the kids. Yeah. Yeah. It, 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 do carpenters go home and go? It's the wood. Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> You know, the one thing I miss about teaching is seeing that growth. It's mm. like, I, I, I'm extremely grateful for what we're able to do with what you do, you know, but we are kind of, you know, we're flavor of the day, if you will. You know, we show You get a snapshot. Oh, yeah, now it's coming in, folks. There it is, man. Where were you? No, it should be, really. Next to the fire. We'll put it right to the fire, just in case.
I may not remember a lot about third grade, but I'll definitely remember my day today here in Little Leg Harbor with my good friend, brother-in-law, and favorite third grade teacher, Mr. Michael Bocchicchio. Like a good Schwinn bike, fun and adventurous. I'm a spaz, my kids are spazzes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Hey, it's, it's that new math's fault, right? Ah, <laughs> oh, that's up. To the old math! <laughs> oh, you wanna get out of here? Let's get out of here.